wholesale inflation has turned negative for April, the first time since July 2020. Well, Priyanshi is out actually decoding what that means. Priyanshi. So, as we see in there, this is also because of the base effect that prices have fallen compared to a record high inflation last year. So, the wholesale price inflation, they're turning negative. Also, the wholesale inflation was uh, down this year negative compared to record 15% inflation last April. Prices have fallen compared to that record inflation because of the Ukraine war last year. So, that situation stabilizing, especially global fuel prices. And the biggest drop in India coming in fuel and power wholesale inflation. Priyanshi, let's go across to you for more on decoding those numbers. Well, Sonia, let's first tell you the numbers, but we're coming to you from a petrol station here in the national capital region that will really explain how the wholesale price inflation fall is not impacting customers. First, if we talk about the numbers, wholesale price inflation has turned negative for the first time since July 2020. That means that the wholesale prices have actually fallen in the month of April compared to April last year. The wholesale price inflation for April is at minus 0.92% compared to 1.34% in the month of March. Now, let's first understand understand why has this really happened you have to understand first that this price rise is in comparison with a record price increase last year so the prices of April are being compared to record high prices in the month of April last year last year prices were increasing and they touched a record high wholesale price inflation touched a record high of 15 percent in the month of April last year because of the war that led to a rise in fuel prices and now we are seeing that when we compare these prices prices in the month of April 2023 to the record high prices in April 2022. That's why we are seeing a fall in the prices because they are compared to record high prices and not normal prices. And now let's come to what has contributed to the fall in prices. Last year after war, the Brent crude prices were around $130 per barrel. Now they have come down to around $70 per, per barrel. So that's a fall of almost 40%. Because of that, fuel price wholesale inflation has fallen from 9% in the month of March last year to now 0.9%. So that is the category with the highest fall in inflation. But right. as you can see, there's no impact on consumers. Petrol prices still at 96 rupees per liter. The same since May last year because retailers are not passing on this relief to consumers. So the fall in wholesale prices is only reducing their input prices and increasing their profit margin. So now there's increased pressure for them to cut fuel prices to bring some relief to consumers. Consumers. Right.